Use the clickable sections below to keep track of what step you're on in this tutorial. To set up a Minecraft server, you will need to have Java installed onto your computer. First, you will need to go to minecraft.net slash download slash server. You will then be led to this website. On this website, you will find a .jar file which is the installer you need to set up a Minecraft server. This is a server setup provided by Minecraft's official website. This link will show the latest available version of Minecraft. Click on this link to download the server setup. Create a new folder, then drag and drop the downloaded file into it. Open up the folder and double click on the server.jar file. After doing so, you will notice there are new files being created in this folder. Double click and open the eula file. Next to eula equals false, you will need to change false to true in order to enable your Minecraft server. After enabling your server, make sure you click on file and then save. Go back to the main folder and double click on the server.jar file again. This will add more files to your folder. A new window will pop up showing you the current logs and status of your server. You will need to wait for a short moment for the server to finish setting up. Once you get a message saying done, that means your server is online. Go back into the server folder, then right click on server properties. Click on open with, then notepad. In this file, you will find all your game settings. You can edit many things such as enabling or disabling player versus player, changing the game mode, setting up the maximum number of players, and more. You can also change the name of the server here. Keep in mind that you will need to keep this window running in the background while playing on your Minecraft server. If you change any of the settings in the server properties file while being on the server, you will need to close this window and then click on the server.jar file again to restart the server and enable the new changes you made. When launching Minecraft, make sure you select the same version as the Minecraft server. For example, if your server is in version 1.16.5, you will need to launch Minecraft in 1.16.5 as well. To access the server, go to Multiplayer, then Add Server. In the server address slot, type localhost. Then click Done. This should add the server to your server's list. To give yourself the ability to use commands in-game or to become a server admin, go back to the Minecraft server window. Then type in op and your Minecraft username. Then hit enter. When you go back into the game, you will be able to use commands. To invite other people and friends to join your server, you will need to give them your IP address. Make sure you only share your IP with people you trust to stay safe online.